Transportation accounts for a quarter of global CO2 emissions. And many people think that electric vehicles are the solution. But the truth is, they still emit carbon dioxide when produced, assembled, and transported. In fact, emissions from making EVs can be 70% higher than petrol models. European energy supplier Vattenfall has a mission to remove fossil fuels from all parts of society, including the production of electric vehicles. They asked us to inspire the automotive industry to change by showcasing their expertise in cutting carbon emissions from production chains. What we proposed wasn't a campaign, but a product. One bike built to change how all vehicles are made. Vattenfall teamed up with the electric motorbike manufacturer Cake to make the world's first vehicle produced without fossil fuels. The bike is perfect for a project like this, as it's made of similar parts to any EV. There's just fewer of them. Every single part is being replaced with fossil-free innovations. The project launched with a campaign that visualized the problem. When produced, like most products, it emits carbon dioxide, 637 cubic meters to be precise, enough to fill this cube. Every piece of data was made open source, available for all. Normally, valuable R&D findings are classified, but the reality is the climate doesn't care about company secrets. The point wasn't to make one fossil-free vehicle. It was to inspire an industry to speed up the change. And we are. Olin's suspension supplier to Ferrari, BMW and Volkswagen has joined the project to develop fossil-free suspension. 20 companies, including Polestar, are in talks about implementing fossil-free plastic. And this is just the beginning. By 2025, we aim to have a bike with zero impact on the climate, but maximum impact on cutting carbon emissions from automotive production. One bike built to change how all vehicles are made.